June 1. My dear Makar Alexievich, I so long to do something nice that will please you in return for all the care and trouble you have taken about me, and all your love for me, that at last I have overcome my disinclination to rummage in my chest and find my diary, which I am sending to you now. I began it in the happy time of my life. You used often to question me with curiosity about my manner of life in the past, my mother, Pokrovskoe, my time with Anna Fyodorovna and my troubles in the recent past, and you were so impatiently anxious to read the manuscript in which I took the fancy, God knows why, to record some moments of my life, that I have no doubt the parcel I am sending will be a pleasure to you. It made me sad to read it over. I feel that I am twice as old as when I wrote the last line in that diary. It was all written at different dates. Goodbye, Makar Alexievich. I feel horribly depressed now, and often I am troubled with sleeplessness. Convalescence is a very dreary business. V. D. Breaking in. It appears that Varvara's long convalescence, to which these last two letters refer, may have been partially caused by the shock of the events that Varvara describes in her April 25th letter. The next two videos are dedicated to the diary that Varvara has enclosed in this June 1st letter. The second part of the diary will constitute the longest video of this compilation by far. End of comments.